Looking for the best motherboard to pair with AMD Radeon RX 7900 XTX? RX 7900 XTX is currently AMD's best GPU targeted at 4K gaming and with 24GB of GDDR6 VRAM. It will stay relevant for many more years to come. In this video, I chose the best AMD motherboards to pair with this high-end GPU, starting first with the top budget pick, then the best high-end, and lastly the overall best value motherboard. So let's start. Price information and all motherboards mentioned in the video are available in the description. Number 3. MSI Pro B650MA Best budget AMD motherboard to pair with Radeon RX 7900 XTX. The MSI Pro lineup of motherboards has proven to be a reliable choice for simple office or workstation PCs. With the introduction of the new Ryzen 7000 CPUs, MSI has made notable improvements to the VRMs, and this is apparent in the Pro B650MA. Still by current standards, the VRMs on this board are considered modest yet capable. It features a set of 8-phase VRMs that are effectively cooled by a thick heatsink. As a result, even under an all-core load with a stock 7950X, the VRMs only reach a maximum temperature of 78 degrees Celsius. Of course, I do not recommend anyone to get a 7950X for this motherboard, but this does go to show the premium quality even on a budget-friendly motherboard. Performance is an overall advantage of this board, and even the RAM support is excellent. Usually, MSI boards do not clock memory much higher than 6400 mega transfers per second, but this board does support up to 7200 mega transfers per second DDR5 RAM. If we take a look at the rear I.O., MSI has kitted the Pro B650MA with eight USB Type A ports, where four of them are running at USB 3.2 Gen 1 and four of them at USB 3.2 Gen 2 speeds. Sadly, there isn't a single USB Type-C port on the rear I.O. Also, MSI should have added at least two USB 2.0 Type-A ports because now you'll have to use two USB 3.2 Type-A ports for peripherals like a mouse and keyboard. Thankfully, the front I.O. has four USB 2.0 Type-A, one USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C, and two USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A ports, which does alleviate some of my concerns. The rear I.O. also has a BIOS flashback button, which is fantastic for upgrading the BIOS without needing to install a compatible CPU. Other than that, everything else you get is pretty standard, like HDMI 2.1, DisplayPort 1.4, Wi-Fi 6E, Bluetooth 5.3, 2.5 gig LAN, and a standard 3-port array of audio jacks. When it comes to aesthetics, the MSI Pro lineup of motherboards has a simple all-black design. It's not for showing off your PC, but rather something with a tried and true formula and a look that won't clash with anything else. Being a micro ATX board, there aren't going to be as many PCIe slots as one would expect from a full-sized ATX board. The total, you get two M.2 SSD slots and three PCIe slots for expansion. The first PCIe slot is a proper X16 PCIe 4.0 slot that is connected directly to the CPU. The other two slots are just simple PCIe 3.0 times 1 and PCIe 4.0 times 4 slots. It would make sense to go with this board's bigger brother, the MSI Pro B650P Wi-Fi, if you really want an extra PCIe slot and a stronger VRM if you have a much bigger budget to spend on the motherboard. In terms of competition, the most interesting alternative is the AS Rock B650M Pro RS Wi-Fi, which is very similar to this motherboard in many ways. The reason why I prefer the MSI Pro B650MA Wi-Fi is that for just $10 more, you get a neater design, an extra PCIe slot, and much better USB ports. The AS Rock is a good choice if you're looking to squeeze as much of your budget as possible and really want a USB Type-C port on the back. But it is clear that the B650MA Wi-Fi is hard to pass, especially given how similarly priced they both are. In conclusion, the MSI Pro B650MA is going to be the ideal choice for budget Ryzen machines. Its solid VRM is what mainly makes it a worthy recommendation. It doesn't go overboard in any shape or form and just gets the job done. All these make it ideal for a budget PC with the RX 7900 XTX. To sum up what I like is the strong VRM design even on a budget. 
It has plenty of fast USB 3 ports and the Wi-Fi and Bluetooth support out of the box. On the downside, it doesn't have any USB Type-C ports in the rear. Our ratings for VRM design is 8 out of 10. Features, 8 out of 10. Aesthetics, 7.5 out of 10. Value for money, 9 out of 10. For an overall rating of 8 out of 10. Number 2. Gigabyte X670E Aorus Master. Best high-end AMD motherboard to pair with Radeon RX 7900 XTX. The Gigabyte X670E Aorus Master is an exceptional motherboard perfect for users seeking to unleash the full potential of their CPU and GPU. Its fantastic feature set, stunning design, and compatibility with the latest technology make it the best high-end motherboard for Radeon RX 7900 XTX, especially if you plan to overclock your CPU to the max and need top 4K gaming performance. With its astonishing 16 plus 2 plus 2 phase VRM design and advanced cooling solutions, such as Finzer A3, Mega Heat Pipe, Thermal Pad, and dedicated heat sinks for each M2 slot, the Aorus Master ensures optimal power delivery and stability. In addition, these features contribute to impressive thermal performance during extreme overclocking sessions, satisfying the needs of performance enthusiasts. In terms of storage, it truly shines with its diverse and lightning-fast options. Boasting four M2 slots and six SATA ports, this motherboard accommodates various storage configurations, including two PCIe 5.0 times 4 M2 slots for cutting-edge storage technology. Furthermore, its support for up to 128GB of DDR5 memory and a maximum frequency of over 6600 MHz makes it a future-proof investment for users looking to stay ahead of the curve. Connectivity-wise, the board stands out with unmatched PCIe and USB support. It caters to every possible need, featuring three PCIe slots, including one PCIe 5.0 slot for superior graphics card performance and an extensive selection of USB ports. The Wi-Fi 6E and Bluetooth 5.3 support also add to the appeal of this high-end motherboard. These features cater to both gamers and content creators, making it a well-rounded option for users with varying needs. Not only is the X670E Aorus Master a powerhouse in terms of performance, but it also boasts a stunning design with a sleek black finish on the PCB and captivating RGB effects on the I.O. cover. It adds a touch of elegance to any build, making it a great choice for those who value aesthetics in addition to performance. Nevertheless, you should consider the form factor of the X670E Aorus Master as it is an EATX motherboard so you must ensure that you have a compatible PC case to accommodate the larger size of this motherboard. In conclusion, the Gigabyte X670E Aorus Master is a top-tier choice for performance enthusiasts and high-end users who prioritize power, cooling, and advanced features. Its impressive feature set and stunning design make it the best high-end motherboard for the RX 7900 XTX, especially if you plan to overclock your CPU. While it may come at a premium price, the performance and experience it offers make it a worthwhile investment for those who demand the best. Number 1. AS Rock X670E Steel Legend – Our Top Choice I'd say that AS Rock is pretty bold to call this motherboard a legend, but I don't think they are quite off on that, and that's why the AS Rock X670E Steel Legend is my top pick board to pair with the Radeon RX 7900 XTX. What makes this one of the best motherboards available in the market is that on top of having all the necessities, it also has an excellent VRM design, 16 plus 2 plus 1 phases at 60 amp. So running even the 7950X at high clocks won't be an issue. A rather rare feature of the Steel Legend is its two Ethernet ports, one being 1 gigabyte and the other 2 gigabyte. It also comes with an insane number of USB ports. I counted a total of 12 in the back, with support for 5 more in the front. Perhaps my favorite feature of this motherboard is the inclusion of a graphics card holder. This included holder is perfect for giant GPUs like the RX 7900 XTX, so that they won't sag. I wish more vendors included this nowadays. This is truly the best value seekers board. Reliable power delivery, sturdy board design, overloaded with features, and an excellent price to match. What more can one want? 
Also, unlike the Steel Legend, most boards in this price range don't offer Gen 5 support on the Time 16 slot. All in all, I needed a board that would yield the most value. Being a budget board does not mean that it just needs to be cheap and cut corners. At the end, I really wanted to recommend the Gigabyte X670 Gaming XAX as the top choice for the RX 7900 XDX. However, right now, the price of the Steel Legend is just $30 more than the Gaming X, and it overshadows the Gaming X in terms of features, and that makes it the ideal choice.